As a designer, are you able to ensure that all the parts in your design are operating within their stress limits? Even if you measure critical components for stress levels, you might end up overheating your PCB. With ORCAD, you can easily measure stress levels for all the components in your design to help define the safe operating limits for your circuit. Let's consider this circuit, a triangular wave generator, and analyze its component stress using smoke analysis. First, run piecewise analysis to check the default behavior of the circuit. Once that's complete, go to the piecewise menu and select Smoke from Advanced Analysis. In the Smoke Analysis graph, you will see gray and green bars for all the components in your circuit. The green bars represent safe operating limits, whereas the gray bars indicate the limits are invalid. If you have components outside their safe operating limits, they will show in red. We don't need RMS or average values for a transistor, so we can right-click on the graph and select Hide Invalid Rows. With smoke analysis, you can predict the safe operating limit of your circuit based on the derating factor of components in your circuit. Here, the derating factor allows you to operate your devices at less than rated maximum capability. In the Smoke Analysis window, right-click on the Percent Derating column and choose Standard Derating and Rerun Smoke. You can see that the bar for Q3 and Q4 have now turned red. Let's consider Q3. With Standard Derating, the value of VCE is reduced by 50% to 6 volts from 12 volts. And the measured value after simulation is 6.55, which is 10% higher than before. This indicates that there will be component failure when operated at 50% less than rated value. The best way to fix this is to replace these components. Here, standard derating values are decided by the tool, but you can also set your own derating values using the Customize option. Notice that when you select the standard derating, the derated value is given to each component of your circuit and simulation results are displayed on the right side of the color-coded bars making it easy to find affected components in your design. To replace the components, first, right-click on the red bar and choose Find in Design. You'll jump to the Q3 NPN transistor. Now with the symbol selected, go to the Place menu and select Search from Piecewise Components. A search window will be docked on the right side. In the search window, type NPN transistor 30 volts, since we want the same transistor but with better parameters. After replacement, rerun piecewise and smoke analysis. Now the smoke results for the updated design are all green. With ORCAD, it's easy to identify stress levels of components and replace the problematic components, therefore making your designs more robust and reliable.